Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel. I'm Concrete Mermaid and I'm gonna be showing you guys how I do my ombre lips. As you can see, my lips are very dry. I literally waited to go on camera to show you guys what I do before I add any lipstick. So I'm just going in with a rosy um, lip treatment. And you can get this like literally anywhere, maybe a CVS um, pharmacy beauty supply store. I'm gonna actually use a small amount just because when applying the lip liner, it literally like glides off the lips. So I don't wanna go too crazy on this. So I don't need to show you guys how to moisturize your lips. I'm sure you know how to do that. <laughs> that yeah you don't want to apply lip gloss or lipstick over dry lips it's not fun I've done that before Once your lips are fully moisturized, you're gonna go in with your lip pencil. Literally says lip pencil on here. I got this from a beauty supply store in Queens by my old apartment. And my pencil isn't looking that great right now. So you can sharpen yours. I don't know where my sharpener is, so I am just going to use this. This has a, a pretty decent point, so not too bad all right here's the fun part so some people do this some people just do this I do both um, I guess you'll see as I do it because you know it's kind of like hard for me to explain but I'm just going to follow the lip line and let me get closer to you guys for that all right, here we go See, this is the reason why I said don't use too much um, moisturizer for the lips because you want this product to just glide on and sometimes it doesn't do that when the product like rubs off on the pencil. So. And this doesn't have to be perfect because I'm gonna actually blend everything in. look so big right now <laughs> oh I look like a little bobblehead <laughs> okay I don't have a cat but why do I feel cat hair I mean I do have a cat but my cat doesn't live with me right now because my cat's at well my family cat it's a family cat and I literally felt cat hair in my hair hole in my, my mouth. Oh yeah, I had cat hair in my mouth, but listen, it could have been worse, right? Okay, so let's continue to do this. And let's go in, line it around. Use your pencil liner and go around the lip, like so. Okay, so far so good. Your lip is supposed to look like this. Not perfect, listen, just line the lip okay this one looks a little lower than this one so let's go out a little bit more Wait. 
All right, I have this old lipstick. Um, it's from Elf. Well, it's not that old. Actually, I don't even know when I got it, so it probably is old. Um, and I rarely use it, because look. <laughs> but I was looking for something with a, like, a nude color. I don't really wear nude. Um, but this is the closest. I had one. It was like more of a lip, lip, uh, liquid lipstick. And I can't find it. So this is the one we're using today. So I'm going like this. That looks crazy. <laughs> but we're not done. <laughs> And this is another e.l.f. product, and this one's actually new. And I'm only going to take a tad bit of this, and like, that's probably too much. I'm gonna actually take a bit of that off, because I don't want so much of that color. Yeah, okay. So, that's great, that's good. Okay, okay, okay. I'm going to go in with a a clear lip gloss however mine is not clear because i'm always mixing things so and this one's empty so let me go grab one i'll be right back so i have a clear again it doesn't look clear because i've mixed so many lipsticks in this so that's why it's not clear but you're gonna go in with your lip gloss preferably one that has a mini brush and just apply that. So for me, I feel like I want to add a little bit more lip liner because I like it for it to be a little bit more darker. But also, I like this. It looks good. It looks good. Usually, I just and blend it with the brush. All right, I, I feel like I have to go in the light for this. Um, let me move. All right, I hope this is a little bit more brighter for you guys, but I am gonna go in with a little bit more lip liner after everything. This was supposed to be the total final look, um, but I wanna get some more brown in there. finished what do you guys think it's natural nothing crazy I'm feeling it I like it it's more natural which that's usually what I go for However, I think if I had went in with a lighter nude color, it would have popped more in the middle here. But because of the color that I used, where is it? It's more on the darker side, so it's not going to show up as uh, light. Can you see that? So, usually I use a lighter lipstick. I like this, it's very natural. Once again, thank you for tuning in, and I hope you found this video helpful. Bye, see you in the next video.